Hello guys, this is the second part of using AI to create Etsy print on demand business. In the first video, we set up our Etsy store, signed up with Printify and connected it to Etsy. Now we are going to design our first print and we are going to use AI to generate stunning images for us. If you haven't watched the first video, I would highly recommend you watch that first. First, we are gonna need some design ideas, so I'm gonna ask ChatGPT for some ideas. Simply type, give me a list of short quote ideas for t-shirt design on photography. I'm being very specific with t-shirt, but don't worry, once you have the design, it can be applied to any products you want, mugs, pillowcases, phone cases, etc. So I like this one, so I'm gonna copy it and paste it in Figma. By the way, Figma is a free software that you can download to design your prints. Alternatively, you can use Canva or Photoshop if you are already familiar with those. All the mentioned software and website will be in the description box. Now head over to pixabay.com and search and download a free t-shirt mockup and drop it into Figma. Play around with the text to find the sweet spot. By the way, if you want cool looking fonts like this, head over to fonts.google.com and download them for free. So to generate images, you can either use free AI generator tools such as Stable Diffusion or DALI 2 or you can use paid tools such as Midjourney. The process is basically the same. You give the description of what you want the end results to be and the AI will generate images for you. I have the subscription to Midjourney so I'm gonna Gonna be using it for this video so when you are on the mid journey type the command backslash imagine prompt followed by the description of the image you want to generate for instance if you type backslash imagine prompt cute cat holding a camera cartoon white background and white waters try including the clean background or white background in your command so that removing the background will be easier later so after you are done the image generator gives you four images that you can either upscale or make the variation of each image i like this image so to upscale it click on u2 now open the upscale image and click on open in browser right click on the image and save the image on your computer so now to remove the background head over to photop.com which is the free alternative to photoshop and drop the downloaded image into it click on select option from the top navigation bar and remove background. It automatically removes the background for you. Now export the image into your computer. Take the exported image and drop it into Figma. Select the image, hit K to scale and adjust accordingly. You can also make different variations of the same design such as only image, only text or both. There you go. You have three designs ready in no time. After you are done, you need to export two variations of each design. First the design only for printing. Next the design with t-shirt mockup for thumbnail. Okay as the design is ready, let's create our first list listing. To do that, head over to printify.com and click on catalog and t-shirt. By the way, Printify connects businesses with printing service providers. So when you get the order in your store, you ask the print provider to print the product and deliver the products to your customer directly. All right, on the catalog, you can see best seller. So select one. I'm going to be choosing this one. Now you can see the print providers for that t-shirt. If you are targeting to sell in the United States, print provider in the US will give you the fastest delivery time. I'm going to choose Monster Digital by clicking on start designing. Now upload the design you created on Figma, adjust your design to be inside the frame. You can choose what colors you want to include in your listing. I normally go with black, white, gray and navy blue. After you are done, you can preview the designs by clicking on preview. If you are happy with how your design looks, simply click on save product. Now click on the product you created. This is the listing description page. As we have already connected Etsy with Printify, whatever you mention here will automatically be updated on Etsy store listing as well. Alright, you have to understand that our goal is to rank on Etsy soil. And to do that, the title, description, tags and the product images should be optimized. So we are going to look for what people are searching for in Etsy and put those keywords into our title, description and tag. So head over to Etsy search section and type photography for our example design. You can see different suggestion come up for the keyword. So what you want to do is copy those keywords and mention in your title, description and tags. Also you can spy on your competitors, look at what's working for them and get some idea. You can do the same for the description as well or you can ask chat GPT to give you a detailed description. Simply type write me an optimized product description with the keyword photography t-shirt for Etsy. With ChatGPT, make sure you only use what is required and appropriate. Alright, after you are done, scroll down to the pricing section and set up your retail price as you want. Again, you can look for what your competitors are selling the similar items for and get a rough idea. When you are done setting up the price, scroll down to the sync product details section and select everything. And finally, hit publish. Now head over to Etsy, click on shop manager and go to listings. You can see the listing you created on Printify. Here you can edit the products in more detail. So we have already optimized the title description. Now let's upload the mockup you designed in Figma earlier. Scroll down to the tags and add relevant tags and finally hit publish. There you go. Your store is ready with one product listing. Now what you want to do is come up with more design ideas and keep on adding your listings. The more design you list, the more chance you have of ranking on the Etsy algorithm. 
all right this is the end of the video if you found this video helpful it would really help if you could like the video consider subscribing and turning on the notification for upcoming videos and as always thank you for watching cheers guys have a good one